Hey YouTube, it's Karen here. Well, I'm on a uh, treasure hunt. In my last video I had asked about the little tiny can opener that people use. I couldn't remember the name. And one of my subs, Freth Kindheart, so graciously is giving me one, but he's he's hit it on the trail with a few other small tokens, I guess. He said don't get too excited about it, but I thought it was fun. He uh, lives nearby the park that I go to. He lives a little south, and I live a little north, so he's hit a package on the trail, and he's given me a clue, and the first clue says, I know this much, you're damned if you do. So that's where we're going, the top of the dam. And then I'll read the next one. <laughs> He's so nice. <laughs> this is really fun. Okay, the next clue says, The path was laid out before me in dark asphalt, but soon gave way to a metal grate. And then grass, so that's the metal grate and that's the dam. The next clue he gave was, I traveled beyond the gray pipe. And right there's the gray pipe. That kind of threw me off at first, until I remembered they were laying there. Then his next clue, it says, beyond the yellow tree. Well, I don't see no yellow trees around here. But I do see a yellow I don't know, metal things sticking out of the ground. So that has to be it. Next one says, I'm beyond the open meadow. So that's an open meadow. Well, the next clue says, I came to a quaint path, soft and green, but I was daunted drawn to a tree to the left of the entrance. I was sure something was there. So, have to, gosh, I hope I don't get stung by a bee. I'm going to get my sandals on. Either that tree or that tree down there. Right there it is. Huh, I'll open it up and see what's in there. Oh, let's, let's sit down. Like a nice bandana. Hmm. Oh, I think it's a uh, Fresno lens. Oh, cool. I don't even have one of them yet. <laughs> And he was showing these on one of his videos. They're them little pill cylinders. And he does a really neat trick with the lid. Let me turn the camera off for a second and no, undo it. 
Yeah, it's just one of those cylinders, you know, you can keep tinder in it or matches or maybe pills. But when you go to his channel, because I want all my subs to go to his channel, visit him, say hi, and sub him. And I'll put the uh, link to his channel down in the uh, my description box. But he uh, puts wax in that lid and makes a little candle. Um, beeswax. I don't have none of that either. That's cool. Thank you. And that's probably my uh, can opener. Just a minute. Yep, that's what it is. It's the P38 uh, military style can opener that I wanted. Some people say they're kind of hard to find. But thank you very, very much. I really appreciate you taking the time to go hide this <laughs> nice present. And that was really nice of you. And I, I can use everything. <laughs> and that's one of the, those tin. That tin is the kind that screws on too, not pops on. They're really nice. I think you get them from survival resources, if I'm not mistaken. But, um... I'll put the link to uh, his channel down in the description. I'd like all my subs to pop on over there and say hi to him and watch some of his videos and sub him. He's got some great stuff on bushcrafting and I think prepping, a little bit of cooking. Hadn't watched him uh, in a while because uh, he got a new channel and I didn't know it. But uh, pop on over there and and visit him he's a, a a nice guy and he's got a great channel so thank you very very much i really appreciate it and it was fun really a lot of fun thanks for watching